All right, let's get into this. A third yeah. of people in relationships consider their other half to be the most annoying person in their life because of their irritating habits. So do you fall into this category? Are you annoying? Is that why I'm in the middle? Yes. Am I? Yep. I was not expecting this. <laughs> well, let me get ready here. All right, here we go. <laughs> right, are, you, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Let me see if I have the cards. Okay. Gene Rayburn. You got your letters out? Your A, your B, your C? I got A, B, or C. Apparently, I just can't say. A, Ladies B, and gentlemen, C. it is oh. time to play Are You Annoying? I'm your host, Thomas Dre, and let's meet our contestants. Karen Hepp, good to see you. Winner. Mike Jarek, good to see you. So which one are you most annoying? Are you ready for question number one? You're about to go out for a night on the town together. Your partner tries out a new look. What do you say? A, you're going out in that? B, oh, your outfit is, hmm, interesting. Or C, you look lovely, darling. Ooh, we went with C. Question number two, you're catching up together on the latest episode of your favorite crime drama. You, A, shout out what you think the murderer is, every twist and turn, who you think it is. B, during a quiet moment, chat about something that happened to you today. Or C, you shut up and let them watch it in peace. Let's say you. Ooh, Mike says A, Karen says B. You know what the A stands for? Annoying. Annoying, well, we'll see at the end here. Question number three, you've taken your underwear off, so where do you put it? A, on the floor, where else? B, bundle up in your wardrobe so it's out of the way, or C, in the laundry basket, or better, the washing machine. Karen says C, Mike says A, on the floor, where else? All right, you dirty dog. Question number four, your partner is telling a funny story to friends, but gets one small detail wrong. You, A, loudly interrupt them in mid-sentence and correct them, causing them to lose their train of thought. B, let them finish, but correct them afterward. Or C, you smile, you nod, you laugh. We all make mistakes. That's Ooh. definitely true for you. I'm trying to be better, so you I'm gonna, I'm gonna be. Or I'm really trying to be C. We're like, does it matter? Like, do I care what town it happened in? No. Do I care like who the person was that was? No. The person we don't know was talking. It's fine. Trying is not part of this game. All right. Hey, did All right get let's a get B? back. So you're going with, <laughs> you're going with B. Let them finish. Correct them afterwards. Question number five. Your partner is getting ready for work and about to shower. What do you do? You A jump in before them and have a lengthy shower. <laughs> you B brush your teeth while they wait at while they wait outside in a towel. Or C, wait your turn. I, I go in and brush my teeth. You wait your turn while they're in the shower. Yeah. I'm not gonna wait for them, but I'm not gonna like barge in anyway. So, you, I, so I, you let them take the shower. Do you know people that brush their teeth in the shower? My husband. I'm, I'm married to one. Yeah. Do you shave and then in he the leaves shower? the tough no. toothbrushes I, in there. Yeah. I occasionally you shave in the shower. Yeah. Yeah. I, oh. I cut myself shaving today. We is saw. that what that is? Yeah. It's your likely excuse. It looks like it's spreading. Question number six. <laughs> You've got plans together at 7 p.m. It's already 6.50. What are you doing? A, you jump back from the gym. I cut off the questions. All right, so you've got plans together at 7 p.m. It's already 6.50. What are you doing? Let's get to the questions here. We're going to get to it here. Sammy is uh, at, at the controls. Thank you. I appreciate it. So how are you all doing? You doing We're doing well? fine. Great. How the, how's the family? Family's Doing great. Off yeah. the college, How's the really? hardwood? Yes. All right, here we go. A, just back from the gym. You are now getting into the shower. Time is merely a concept. B, you frantically iron a top. Or C, ready to go once you get your coat on. What do you do? You are running late. You B. I'm say I'm pretty good. My husband's either getting into the shower where I can't believe we're gonna leave, but he gets ready very quickly. So he's either A or C. You're still ironing, you are ready to go, you got your coat on. And I I'm ironing on the floor because I don't even take the time to get an ironing board out. I can't believe you're ironing. I don't feel like I've ar like oh, ironed yeah, yeah. since like the Reagan administration or something. No, I can iron. All right. Were you, were you keeping track to find out who's okay, so now mostly you a C, mostly and I'll tell you exactly what I mean. Okay, Sammy is in the control room uh, yes. adding up the scores. Okay, question three. You've taken your underwear off, so where do you put it? Mine's in Mike the laundry. Mike says on the floor A, Sammy. And uh, Karen said C. She puts it in the laundry basket. Better or the washing machine? Okay, so Karen is mostly B's and Mike is mostly A's. And if you scroll down here, are your answers. Okay, so Karen's mostly B. We'll start with Karen. Mostly B, you are slightly annoying at times. So if you're a B, 
you're normal. I advise that you listen to your other half when they tell you how your inconsiderate behavior makes them feel. Okay. <laughs> Are you willing to listen? I'm trying. I think this is a runaway win for me. Mostly A, you are extremely annoying. <laughs> My advice for your partner would be to leave you at once. <laughs> and ensure they get a good lawyer. Oh, God. Don't! <laughs> well, I, I do live alone. <laughs>